Hello, my name is Emre. Hello, my name is Emre. We are brother. Today we make a Shopska salad. We can eat Shopska salata. The products are tomatoes, cucumber, pepper, onions, cheese, parsley, oil, vinegar, salt, olives. finish Hello I'm Darian and I and my mother are going to cook tripe soup Ingredients are onion garlic butter pre-cooked tripes salt paprika flour, milk, hot water and Bulgarian spices and chili. I onion and garlic uh, oil, uh, add salt and paprika. Add hot water and milk. Add pre-cooked tripes. And Bulgarian spices and chili. After 10 minutes, soup is ready. Mmm, this is a great soup. I will cook stew. Potato, onion, carrot, meat, peas, paprika, uh, salt and flour. After we cut the onions, the potatoes and the carrots, I add them to the meat and put them in the pot. Then add paprika, flour, water and bring to a boil. This is the end result. It's very tasty. Hello friends, I am Marian. I'm 13 years old from the town Targoviste in Bulgaria. Today I'm cooking with my grandma. This dish is quite easy to make and it's delicious. The products you need are 1 liter fresh milk, oil, water, 4 to 5 spoons of, of flour, salt and red pepper. The first thing you have to do is put the milk and salt together and heat it up. While that's heating up, we have to mix the flour and the water. Flour and water. We have to put it in and stir constantly. After it thickens, we have to take it out of the fire. After we take out the milk, we have to fry the oil and the red pepper. After it's done, we have to pour it on the dish. Goodbye, friends. Hello, we're Emel and Eva and we will show you how to make Bulgarian moussaka. First, you need some potatoes, one carrot, one onion and some minced meat. Then you put the sliced onion in the pot and turn on the heat. After the onion is cooked, you add the minced meat and then you add the black pepper, salt, savory and paprika in the same pot. After that, you cut the potatoes in small pieces. You put them in tray and you add vegeta. Then you add the first mix of minced meat and the sliced onion with the kitchen herbs in the second mix. And you mix all this. Then you put it in the oven for some minutes. 
Meanwhile, you have to prepare three eggs and one yogurt. Then you bring the eggs and mix them with the yogurt. After all that, you take the mixture out of the oven and put the other mixture on top of the first one. And the last tip is to put all that in the oven and when it's ready, you can enjoy Yeah, you got that yummy, yum, the yummy, yum, the yummy, yummy. Yeah, you got that yummy, yum, the yummy, yum, the yummy, yummy. Hello, everyone. I'm Sianna Mia, and you can call me Sunny. Today, I will show you how to make Bulgarian banita. The ingredients are pastry layers, oil, gas water, Bulgarian cheese, Bulgarian butter, Bulgarian eggs, and Bulgarian cook. Put some oil on the bottom of the cooking tray. Put three layers on the bottom. Then you smear the cheese on top. Then you put one layer and put some oil on and repeat it three times. Oh, and wait! The oil, the oil has to be just a little bit. Then you smash the um, cheese again. Mmm, that looks so yummy. And don't forget to lick your fingers. The last two layers you leave without oil. And then you have to cut it, but use the help from your parents. butter on small pieces and then put them on all of the squares like this. Crush five eggs into a bowl. Then scramble them well. Add 300 milliliters of water, gas water. And then put all the eggs uh, into the top of the pyramid. Put it in the oven on 170 degrees. This will be your homework from Bulgarian team. It takes like 40 minutes to be ready. Enjoy it. Oh, and don't forget to clean after you. Whew.